Hi there, my name is Sayed Rizvi. How to become successful analyst? In this video, we will take a look at uh, how to become any software analyst and some of the tips and tricks you can learn from that. I have about six uh, tips and tricks in this video. So let's get started. So learn the software. So if you want to become a SAP consultant, you need to learn that software. If you want to become an Oracle analyst, you want to become a Fort Photoshop analyst, graphic designer, whatever it is, you want to learn that software and we want to become expert on this um, and and afterward you need to think about uh, or actually before you need to be, think about if you want to be a developer or you want to be a functional consultant so developer is a person who write code and do programming and write logics uh, and the functional consultant work on the software how functionality works and check the software and do some customization and configuration so that is the difference between developer and functional you need to decide that and then after what you decide you want to become a developer or functional consultant you want to learn the software if you are a developer you need to write code so free resources versus paid content you can find free resources available on youtube you can find some free books on kindle you can find some of the free books online you can check on that for learning uh, paid content you can find some books and you can buy you can buy some courses uh, you can go from there so that is up to you whatever you'd like to decide but there are tons of free software free resources are out there available on youtube and on google you can search uh, after you find whatever course you want to learn take your own notes write it down make it simple then you can learn from that uh, on the same note to make it simple learn faster with mind map that is my favorite uh, trick to learn so mind map is a pict uh, pict uh, pictorial representation of any complex subject into the small graphics you can design you can make this onto the any software uh, ms office powerpoint or there's special softwares are out there for that you can learn you can do that i have a special video for that you can learn that from the video i will put the link in the description below so get certified learn about certification on their website for example if you're on oracle check on their website what uh, type of certification are out there and also foundation certification versus professional certification you can learn uh, start from foundation certification and go on to the professional certification so it's up to you uh, you want to do both or you want to you you want to start from the foundation certification that will be sufficient enough to get started uh, free certification yes there are some free certifications that are out there you can learn from that uh, i think there you can find them on uh, uh, for example i'll give you one example uh, open.sap.com have a free certification from sap that they offer uh, that is uh, you can get a few certifications from there and they offer every quarterly basis they release some new certification also you can pay for that and also it is free uh, I have a video on that. I will put the link in the description below. Okay, discount certification vouchers. So if you get onto the website of the, for example, Oracle or SAP, sometimes they offer discounted vouchers. Check out on their website frequently to see if they're offering any vouchers. Relevant certification. Uh, if you are going for a particular niche, maybe you can get relevant certification and that will help you to become successful analyst from that perspective and if you have more certification that will be good on your resume on your profile okay and uh, on my youtube channel please like and subscribe check out my other books uh, i will put the links of this books on the description below they are available on amazon thank you very much so number three tip is try to get experience uh, you can get this by starting with the internship apply for internship on their website uh, find relevant job for example uh, end user job so if you uh, land a job with the end user then you can go up the ladder and uh, go for a business analyst or a software analyst so that is another way uh, if you have family and friend who are in, in industry of the same software take advice from them they can uh, give you the best advice from their perspective and how to get into the industry and they can help they can guide you how they get into the industry so check if company offer courses on their website uh, you can learn the software from the website own website which is uh, 
and afterward it will help you to get a job maybe if you have a course from the official website there's one more tip i will give this information in the next coming slides keep practicing it so after you learn the software learning is one step and second step to retain the knowledge so how do you retain the knowledge is by practicing it so practice practice and practice so do as much practice if you are want to become an expert on that um, also you how to practice you can get a trial version to get a free access of the software from the website many many software companies offer a trial version you can sign up for that and learn from that uh, and uh, maybe you can buy access if it is available onto the market try to google on that and learn from that so i have another tip from that you can uh, i'll give this in the next uh, slide so after you join a forum you can uh, ask people around there they can help you so join forum is another great tip so for example whatever industry you want to go into you can start joining the forum and after you join the forum you can learn from that software uh, forums are the best place to start learning about subject so so also when you're on the forum you think you learn the software try to solve the problem for other people are, are facing at their work so that is also give you some uh, experience into the market that how things are happening uh, book knowledge and course knowledge is one thing and the practical knowledge is another thing so you can start doing it by day of first when you start learning the software start looking at questions uh, so you can learn from solved questions on their forums so when you see somebody post a question they will be answered by somebody or sometimes the questions is posted but there's no answer you can try to answer this and learn from that uh, try to find all the forums and try to register them if it is two or three forums you want to get on all the forums and see what different types or questions are out there and you can learn from that different forums so that will help you uh, so post a question or answer other people so that is the you, you, need, you need to participate in that so that will help a lot to get a practical knowledge and sometime you never see a question in your experience but you will see on the forum that will give you some knowledge and that will give you some edge to become a successful consultant or analyst so and in the, in the last there is a learn methodology uh, so uh, in the market there are different type of method what is methodology methodology is that when company decide to implement or try to use uh, some different separate way of doing things for example uh, scrum is a methodology and uh, when you see uh, waterfall or sdlc these are, these are the name of the methodology some companies use old methodology you want to learn the old methodology as well and you want to learn the scrum for example or uh, agile type of methodology in the market and that will uh, guide you what day-to-day -day activity will be in this in, in the job market that you are getting into and methodology will define uh, first phase is you doing requirement gathering if it is uh, agile or scrum style of methodology you will have uh, sprints if it is a waterfall and then you do build phase you do test phase and so on and so forth so whatever you want to get industry you want to get into you want to learn uh, old methodology and the new methodology so that way whatever the methodology they are doing it you are frequent in that and you can learn from that so hopefully that video help you uh, please like and subscribe leave a comment and let me know uh, if i miss any tips uh, leave them in the comment below thank you very much